That was a little frequency from the UVB 76 radio transmission that was picked up in Finland back in 2002. Today, we are starting off with the first beer in this series, Roman. Beer, 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 ba, beer, ba, beer, beer. Hello everybody, welcome back to me, Mate Bruski for the Ruski Bruski Review. And today the beer I have for you is by the Wellington Brewing Company. This is from their UVB 76 series, based off of the very mysterious Russian transmission, which was on frequency 46, uh, 4625 kilohertz on shortwave radio. This is a bourbon barrel Asian imperial stout, just like all the other ones in this series, but this is the original bourbon barrel Asian imperial stout style. Coming in at 11.9% alcohol by volume and 60 IBUs. Very, very excited to try this out. Andre, Andre picked these up for me for, uh, for Christmas and I'm just cracking open into them now. So let's, let's start it off. And then we'll go through the logo after because I totally forgot to shoot that. But let's pour it up into my Wellington Brewery pint glass. Now at 11.6, I don't want to pour a lot. It's going to be a big, heavy beer. And look at that. Really, really black. Really, really deep, dark mocha head. Very, very nice. I'm going to let that sit for a second. I'm going to show you off the, uh, the logo because it, it's a Russian cosmonaut in a spaceship. Supposedly a spaceship. Very, very nice. And then you have all the information on the back. So let's have a smell and see how see how this see what the aromas are. I'm getting big chocolate coffee and big, big bourbon. Get some molasses, get some nice vanilla from the bourbon and, and from, from just the barrels probably and just the beer itself. Very boozy, but very, very sweet. Mmm, a little bit of like, like oakiness almost. Very, very nice. Let's have a sip. Woohoo. Oh, wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That bourbon shines through. Holy hell. Yeah, th that bourbon shines through quite quite intense. You get some molasses, you get some dark chocolate and cotton, more, sorry, dark coffee, black coffee in the finish. As for chocolate, I'm not too sure yet. We gotta take another sip. So cheers everybody, let's keep on drinking. Sweet, moving into dark chocolate. Big bourbon with vanilla and some like I don't know some uh, some like like a fruity sweetness almost and then moving into a dark almost like deep cherry sort of deep cherry black uh, or dark chocolate and black coffee finish really really nice really really smooth but a heavy heavy beer mm hmm Actually, I'm a really big fan of this. This is damn, damn good. Holy hell. Let's see what the bottle has to say. So we're going to skip the big uh, description because you've already heard that in the intro. But we're going to read what Roman is about. And Roman, bleh, Roman is the original bur straight bourbon barrel Asian pure Russian stout. With rich coffee, dark cacao, and a smoky bourbon note. This is a beautiful combination of barrels and beer. 11.9% ABV, 60 IBUs, original gravity of 25 degrees Play-Doh, and a final gravity of 4 degrees Play-Doh. 40 SRM, and serving te temp is between 8 to 12 degrees Celsius, and glassware is a goblet, but I have a pint glass. What can you do? Ingredients are water, barley, malt, wheat, malt, ho oats, hops, and brewer's yeast. Brewed by Wellington Brewery in Guelph, Ontario, and artwork by Gordon Ald. Auld, A-U-L-D, Auld. Sorry if I'm mispronouncing your name, good sir. Yeah, very, very nice looking bottle. Good information 
on the back and as well you do have a best before date which is august 16th 2019 very very nice just located just on the shoulder right before the neck of the bottle now this is a big boozy beer that's why I didn't pour that much and it is much more of a slow slow sipper so just uh, you know just be mindful of that so just be mindful of that when you are pouring these beers Moving over to the website now, um, you have both the description, <coughs> both descriptions of the series and the actual beer itself on the website. Very, very nice. And then you have the same exact information as there is on the bottle, ABV, IBUs, OG, FG, glassware, and color. Um, other than that, not too, too much. Um, and then it just a link to the rest of the uh, original UVB 76 bourbon barrel in aged imperial bourbon barrel aged imperial stout series, um, which is which is really really cool. Um, and then you oh, you actually do have uh, you there is a sound clip on here as well. So something that is very, very unsettling and, and, and really just, a wow. That was a male voice transmission at 1639 GMT from, uh, well, I'm not sure if it was posted or if this was when, when the transmission was, was recorded at, uh, in, in uh, September 16th, 2010. So links to that which is on the Wellington Brewery website, uh, will be listed down below for sure, which is very, very, very interesting. Moving over to Untapped, the UVB 76, Roman version of it, has been given a 3.8 bottle caps out of five, and that's out of 275 ratings. Overall, it is a really, really amazing beer. Like I said, I got a little bit of cherries almost. Even though I don't think there are any cherries are in here, which it doesn't seem there are. That's sort of what I'm getting. And I'm, that's definitely from the oak barrels or the barrels from the which, which the bourbon was in. That's the flavor I get and that's the flavor that I am absolutely in love with with this beer. So cheers in the final sip, guys. Let's get ready to ratings. Mm. Smooth, bold, 
boisterous, magnificent. It is a damn, damn good adventurous beer. A big slow sipper to sit back and relax with. But something about it, because maybe because the nameplate of this beer carries that really creepy, mysterious Russian, um, you know, frequency, sort of gives you a very ominous feeling. Uh, and it sort of just sends shivers down your spine, uh, which is which just brings in a whole other dynamic when you enjoy this beer. And I think that in itself, the way that they had this real life thing and connecting it to this beer and to the rest of the style. I haven't had the rest of the style yet, but this this beer is just brings an experience that no other beer has really given me. And I know that, yeah, okay, it, it could be any beer that's connected to this, but just, just the way it's done and the way it makes you feel, especially hearing the the audio clips from this UVB 76 frequency is just, I don't know, Wellington Brewery did something amazing here. They, they didn't just make a really good beer. They put it into a style and linked that style with a story or an event that makes you feel just, you get the heebie-jeebies from it. Even though both beer and, and real story are not connected at all. It just, it, oh, it's weird. It's really weird. You, you have to hear the, the stuff which you've heard and you will see in the descriptions. But wow, yeah, it brings a whole new dynamic to enjoying this beer. And with that, it gets a solid 10 out of 10 just because of just the, ooh, it's, it's so creepy, but so delicious. And it's just kind of, kind of blows your mind a little bit. So 10 out of 10 for this beer, not only because of the beer, but also the experience you get and the feelings you get with this beer, with the transmission, listening to that is just totally unique. Totally, totally unique. As for presentation, you get a lot of information here. You got a great looking logo. You get a description of the series, the buzzer itself, and the beer itself. You get your list of IBUs, ABVs, OG, FG, original final gravities, SRM, which is the color, your serving temp, your glassware, your ingredients, and your best before date on here. And you get the damn transmission, or at least a clip of the transmission that was recorded on the website. 10 out of 10 as well. Before I leave you guys, if you have any comments, questions, or beers you want me to review in the future, you can leave all that information down in the comment box below. If you want to go ahead and like this video or subscribe to me, me Peruski, I'd be greatly appreciate it as well. And with all that said, that's going to do it for me, me Peruski, and the call say, crack a beer and enjoy. Cheers. The Russians were coming.